Okay guys, just going to make myself another coffee and I thought I'd uh, give you more of an idea of the Esbit coffee maker. So, this is what you get. And uh, it's completely stainless steel. You also get a burner, which you can put like a solid fuel tablet in it and kick your boil your coffee up from there. But what I'm doing, just to test it out, before bringing it out into the field is using just the gas hob. So to show you what I've set up so far. This is your pot. And you just fill that with water. Set your wee coffee tray in. Put your coffee in. And on the underneath side you can see we've got a mesh filter with a o-ring and basically just screw that together and then stick it on the gas so I know it's hard having to do all these different reviews and testing cups of coffee and all but um, you've got your spout here so when your water boils it's going to go through that wee hole in where your coffee tray is coming up through there through the mesh filter and out and have a nice cup of coffee. So I um, have tried this on a high heat and a low heat and the low heat works far far better. High heat what happens you just get a big splurge of hot water and um, very lukewarm coffee. So if you put on low heat you get a really nice hot cup of coffee. So we're going to let that uh, kick off on a low heat. It's probably going to take about 5 minutes and uh, I'll come back to you, hopefully just as the coffee is coming out. Now just as another wee tip with um, the stove, um, I know Darren Funky Prepper has it used on the fire and uh, on the gas hob as well at home. Um, you're going to want to make sure you've turned this off as quickly as you can, the gas. Um, because there will be a lot of pressure up in here that's forcing out the coffee. Um, so what I do is just, when it's splurting out, just as I think it's about to finish, turn the gas off. And um, then you're not going to damage your coffee maker. I'm not too sure how that's going to work, getting it out of a fire. Um, sort of more controlled heat with gas, you can put it down quite low. But... Um, Maybe Darren you can chime in on the comments and let me know how um, it works out on the fire, heat wise. But um, so far it's an excellent bit of kit to have a lovely fresh brew coffee without having to stick on a percolator um, if you just want the one cup. Plus this is going to go in my um, get home bag. I'm going to see if I get maybe another one or two for my um, camping gear and um, just so I can treat myself to some fresh coffee when I'm out and about. And here you go, coffee is just starting to come through. Nice and controlled and you see it'll really take off. Just as you see, it's now coming to the boil. I wish you could smell this, <laughs> the smell of freshly brew coffee. And see, so you're getting a nice hot cup. It's not all spurting out. Oh, see, now this is what happens. The water is boiled up right up. Gas off. And there you are. There's your coffee brewed. So, coffee maker from Esbit. Fantastic. Brilliant bit of kit. Very small, compact. To have a nice mug of coffee brewed up in. So, there you are, guys. Um, price point. If you know where to look online, you can probably get this for about £24, £25. Pound. 
Um, they can run from 30, 40 up I've seen on eBay. Um, but you're talking roughly about £24 for it, new. And um, I'd say it's a brilliant bit of kit. So glad I've, I've came across it. And uh, the people have this sort of percolated coffee fresh in the field. So yeah, I'm going to enjoy this and uh, thanks for watching guys.